Thank you for coming. Maybe you can solve this mess. Our missing patrols are being held hostage by Avar, barbarians from the mountains. What are they doing in a bog? That's the thing. Their leader, he wants them to fight you, because you're the Herald of Andraste. What do they have against Andraste? Well, the Avar think there are gods in nature, as in the sky has a god and the forest. The Avar say you're claiming to be sent by one, and they'll challenge the will of your god with their own. I think their leader's just a boastful little prick who wants to brag he killed you. Should I autograph something for him before he tries to behead me? They think readings for the weak, you know, scholars, lowlanders, or legion peasants. Getting to our troops won't be easy. You'll have to fight your way through undead. Wait, you're not squeamish about undead, are you? It doesn't matter. I'm not letting the Avar butcher the Inquisition's people. I appreciate it. The Avar are holed up in the castle on the other side of the Fallow Mire. Make her willing, the Inquisition's people are still alive. The castle! Castle.
Need some rest, but we can return on our own. I can't believe the Herald came for us. I told you she'd come. Looks after you, Herald. There lies the brat. His father, chief of our holding, would duel me for the loss if he cared enough. The Inquisition has a purpose your chief lacks. Join me. Help us stop the breach. Is this why the Lady 
the skies led me here. To help heal the wounds in her skin. Aye, I'll join you. Let me make peace with my kid and I'll find where you set your flag. gaps. Keep focused. They'll know what it means. Remember how to carry your shields. You're not hiding, you're holding. Otherwise, it's useless. Blackwall? Warden Blackwall? You're not. How do you know my name? Who said that? <laughs> That's it. Help or get out. We're dealing with these idiots first. Conscripts, here they come! Sorry, bastards. Good work, conscripts. Even if this shouldn't have happened, they could have... Well, thieves are made, not born. Take back what they stole. Go back to your families. You saved yourselves. You're no farmer. Why do you know my name? Who are you? I've been called a lot of things lately by a lot of people. Well, I'm talking to you. Stop dancing. We're Inquisition. Trying to find out why the Wardens disappeared and if it had anything to do with the Divine's murder. Maker's balls. The Wardens and the Divine. That can't... No, you're asking so you don't really know. First off, I didn't know they disappeared. But we do that, right? No more blight, job done. Wardens are the first thing forgotten. But one thing I'll tell you, no warden killed the Divine. Our purpose isn't political. I'm not here to accuse, not yet. I just need information. I've only found you. Where are the rest? I haven't seen any wardens for months. I travel alone, recruiting. Not much interest because the Archdemon is a decade dead, and no need to conscript because there's no blight coming. Treaties give Wardens the right to take what we need, who we need. These idiots forced this fight, so I conscripted their victims. They had to do what I said, so I told them to stand. Next time, they won't need me. Grey Wardens can inspire, make you better than you think you are. Do you have any idea where the other Wardens could have gone? Maybe they returned to our stronghold at Weishaupt? That's in the Anderfels, a long way north. I don't really know. Can't imagine why they'd all disappear at once. 
let alone where they disappear to. Why haven't you gone missing like the rest of them? Well, maybe I was going to. Or maybe there's a new directive, but a runner got lost or something. My job was to recruit on my own. Plan to stay that way for months. Years. I wasn't aware Grey Wardens could take whatever they want. It's complicated. If there's a blight, everyone has to help the effort to fight it. The treaties are ancient. Outside of blights, it's as binding as a clever tongue can make it. You're no help. I'm no further ahead than I was. Inquisition. Agent, did you say? Hold a moment. The Divine is dead and the sky is torn. Events like these, thinking we're absent is almost as bad as thinking we're involved. If you're trying to put things right, maybe you need a Warden. Maybe you need me. The Inquisition needs all the support it can get. But what can one Grey Warden do? Save the fucking world if pressed. Look, maybe fighting demons from the sky isn't something I'm practiced at. But show me someone who is. And like I said, there are treaties. Maybe this isn't a blight, but it's bloody well a disaster. Some will honor them. Being a warden means something to a lot of people. Warden Blackwall, the Inquisition accepts your offer. Good to hear. We both need to know what's going on. And perhaps I've been keeping to myself for too long. This warden walks with the Inquisition. You go look at it. So much easier to ignore when it's far away. And to actually walk out of it, to be that close. If I hadn't been saved by the Inquisition soldiers, I don't know what would have happened. Inquisition soldiers? That's not what I've heard. The Breach, the Divine's death, the Wardens. It doesn't make sense. There's so much we don't know. Already feeling like part of the team, I see. Too soon? I thought we were building a rapport. So, you already know something of me. What about you? How do you fit into all this? I just want to help stop the war. Try to put things back in order. A worthy goal, one I'm happy to support. For me, I'll be satisfied so long as we find the bastards that killed the Divine. They owe us some answers. I've heard rumors of abandoned warden camps all over these parts. If we have time, I'd like to take a look, see if there's anything we can salvage. I want to hear more about you. <laughs> Compared to yours, my life will seem dull indeed. Your name, Blackwall, doesn't sound Orlesian. Marcher, then. Ferelden. I was from the Free Marchers originally. Markham. That was a long time ago. Another life. I hear that many Wardens were once criminals. You're right. And when you join, your past is forgotten, so let's leave it that way. What did you do before you became a Warden? I was... A soldier, a, a nobody trained to wield a sword and follow orders. I grew weary of fighting other men's wars. So you became a warden? More or less. Becoming a Grey Warden, it's the first time I felt like I mattered. The life I led before seems hollow in comparison. Perhaps one day it will fade away. Why did you join the Wardens? Because they remember honor and sacrifice. Words that have little meaning to the rest of us. Because they lay down their lives for those they have sworn to protect. We all need to believe there are such men in the world. 
I needed to believe I could be one of them. We can continue this discussion at another time. Very well. Inquisitor? Let's talk about the Grey Wardens. You must know a lot about them. Ah, the Wardens. I'm afraid we're less exciting than we seem. The Blight's been over for ten years. What do Wardens do when the world's not ending? There are still Darkspawn. Just because we killed so many in Ferelden doesn't mean they're gone. And the world is not so peaceful that there's no use for good men with swords. Sometimes you have to figure out for yourself what the pledge to protect others really means. It's not always about just archdemons and blights. Where were you during the Blight? I was in Ferelden. On my own, like always. Quietly killed my fair share of Darkspawn too. You haven't had contact with other Wardens for a while. Why were you on your own? It's what I've always done. Recruitment only requires one man. Besides, I've always been a loner. Works best for everyone that way. So you have no idea where the rest of the Wardens are? Do you find that odd? The Blight is over. We don't need an organized force. And orders don't change much from day to day. <laughs> for the last thousand years or so, it's been just find Darkspawn, kill them, repeat as necessary. Let's continue this at another time. As you wish. I'll be here if you need me. At your service. What do you think of the Inquisition? I expected more. More men. Better equipment. You may have Andraste's favor, but wars are won by men. Soldiers. Brute force is not always the answer. There are plenty of other paths to victory. <laughs> True enough. Still, it never hurts to be prepared. One thing I will say about your men. They're passionate. Devoted. You inspire them, build on that foundation, and you will have an army that makes nations tremble. What do you think about all this trouble between the mages and Templars? Looking at it from where we stand, it seems inevitable. But that could be hindsight. How many of us actually saw it coming? Either way, I don't think the Chantry will ever recover. What do you think of Haven? It's a war camp that was once a pilgrim's refuge. It's the state of the world though, isn't it? Holy ground turned into a battlefield. Pity about that temple. Would have been nice to see it. What do you think of the Inquisition's cause? Restoring order is a goal I support wholeheartedly. But that's not the end of it, is it? Not by a half. The Lady Seeker believes we are restoring the Chantry. Others say it needs reform. I don't know where you stand on the matter, and I'll admit I haven't made up my mind either. You must have some feelings about our friends. Don't play Diamondback with Solus. You've been warned. Taught him the game last night. He turned around and beat me at it. Lost everything. Had to walk back to my quarters with only a bucket for my bits. What do you think of my advisors? Leliana seems... nice. Also a little frightening, but mostly nice. Does Leliana frighten you? Has she said anything to you? No, she hasn't said anything. I'd just rather not offend her. I don't want to wake up with a blade in my kidneys if I can help it. We should return to our duties. As you wish. You are, after all, in charge. Yes? You're oddly charming for a man I found wandering the forest. I always thought myself more odd than charming. 
but I'll take a compliment from a lady. They're hard to come by these days. I also find your modesty endearing. And the praise keeps coming. So, is there something large and heavy you need moved? Manual labor in exchange for compliments. Useful. Well, I aim to please. I have to say, my lady, you're unlike any woman I've ever met. I'm flattered you'd spend any time with me. I enjoy your company. Nothing right now. Perhaps in a bit. <laughs>